I was speaking with my good friend Mark Bush, uh, who him, him and his brother run Bush Funeral Home out of Cleveland, Ohio. Uh, they took over, obviously, many multiple generations of serving uh, the Cleveland area. In fact, they've been serving the Cleveland community for over 100 years. Uh, they took over for their father, John, who recently passed away. In fact, he passed away just a couple of weeks prior to COVID-19 and the adjustments that they were forced to make with funeral service at, at, at that time. So he was speaking to me about how important it was and how much it meant to him that while he was standing in the, at the visitation the night before the funeral, uh, he was there and re was receiving families from two to eight, so six hours of receiving families. And he said that as he looked out over the line of people that were waiting to, to offer their condolences and to offer hugs and, and uh, and just support through that. He looked back through the line and he could see some of the colleagues that he works with in the funeral profession that have flown in from all over the place to come and support him and his family. And he, he mentioned to me how much that meant to him. And here we are, we're talking about a funeral home owner who's exposed to death and loss in, on a daily basis helps families walk through this. And he himself was touched and impacted and was so appreciative of that support, but not only that, looked back and realized that he was only just a couple of weeks away from not being able to have that service and to have those people come out and sit with him and cry with him and, and embrace him. And I don't think anybody, I don't care who the family is, they should never walk away feeling like they didn't get the funeral service that they wanted and they didn't get the experience and the support and help that they needed at that time.